The life of the PAC founder and first president, Robert Sobukwe, is being commemorated this month. The APC, which broke away from the PAC in 2007, is traversing the country, spreading Sobukwe's message. Today, APC leader Temba Gordi addressed supporters in Kailicha. Robert Mangaliso Subukwe, born in December 1924 in Grafrenet in the Eastern Cape. He qualified as a teacher and ended up lecturing at Wits. Although literature was his first love, Subukwe soon found himself involved in politics when he joined the ANC Youth League. He was later instrumental in the breakaway from the ANC and moved on to form the PAC and was elected its first president in 1959. Temba Gordi says South Africans owe Subukwe a debt of gratitude for the role he played in the country's history. Robert Subukwe is uh, one of the greatest leaders that this country has had. A man of profound ideas whose ideas were way, way ahead of his time. And a man who has demonstrated in words and in deeds what it means to be a leader. A man who has served, suffered and sacrificed so much for the freedom that we have. A man who today guides the thinking and the approaches of the African People's Convention. Subukwe was also involved in the 1960 anti-pass campaign, which led to the 21st March massacre in Sharpville, now commemorated as Human Rights Day. Soon thereafter, he was sentenced to prison. In 1963, he was kept in solitary confinement in what is today known as Sabukwe House on Robben Island. He was considered one of the most dangerous political prisoners and had no contact with the outside world. However, those who still follow his teachings say he was a man of the people. For us, he's the true embodiment of what a leader should be in this country. And in these trying times as a country, through everything that we're going through, especially through what we witnessed in the sauna last week, um, it is very much important that we are able to keep his legacy going. Robert Sabuka was fighting for ourselves. That's why today we stand for that. We stand for U Robert Sabuka. Sabuka died of lung cancer in February 1978. Abra Barbia, SABC News, Kayalicha, Cape Town.